So last time we took a look at the phone on Texture UK, we took a look at the Vodafone Smart Mini 7. And that was their real budget smartphone. It came in at 35 quid and it was one of the cheapest Android smartphones on the market. This time, Vodafone have sent us very kindly the Vodafone Smart Prime 7. And this is their mid-range smartphone. This is in between flagship and proper budget. So we've got a very, very similar box to last time. We've got the uh, cardboard um, cardboard box here and then on the back, oh this box is the wrong way around, um, giving us some specs. This phone has Android 6.0, um, so the latest version of Android, again obviously with both phones, some of both phones thrown in features. It's got a 5 inch 720p display, an 8 megapixel camera with an incredible 1080p um, uh, video recording, which I am amazed for a phone of this price. Um, it's got a 2.500 mAh battery, which is pretty good. Um, it's got a quad-core um, Snapdragon 210 processor. Uh, it's capable of 4G connectivity, 7.9mm thin. And it's got 8GB of internal storage with 1GB of RAM. So let's get this phone opened up, take the lid off like that. Um, we'll put that over to one side. Um, and then here is the phone itself. So let's just put that here. Um, so this phone, as you can see, it's got a big glass panel up front. It's uh, got uh, some really nice plastic around the sides and then that Vodafone texturing, like we saw in the last, uh, the Spark Mini uh, 7, and very, very similar to that. So what we'll do is we'll power this phone up and we'll get that setting up for now. Let's see what else we've got in the box. We've got our uh, setup instructions. Uh, there, which we won't need. Um, we've also got our thing that comes on the screen. This phone's a review unit, so um, it's probably been used before. So, because um, I have to send my phones back at the end and etc. So, uh, then we've got our charging power cable. Power cable. We've got micro SD at one end, and then we've got your standard USB cable at the other. Rather peculiarly, we've got an EU charger. Um, Obviously the Vodafone guys have sent us uh, an EU model, but that doesn't matter. Um, and then we've also, um, as always with Vodafone, very impressively, we've got um, the Vodafone earphones, which um, still amazes me that they include these in a phone that's so cheap. So that's all that's in the box. So I guess what we'll do now is we'll get this guy up and running, and then we'll give you our first impressions. So there we go, the phone is now up and running. I've installed all the apps I use on an everyday basis ready for testing and as you can see the phone is performing pretty well the screen doesn't look bad either this phone is pretty much running stock android android marshmallow one of the latest versions although of course it does have um quite a bit of vodafone um bloatware on it with all these apps and etc which are a little bit annoying but we'll um but we'll we'll test them out see what they're like i'm, I'm sensing good things for this phone it feels great in the hand it's the perfect size um, and this design I'm already really, really liking. So of course we'll give this phone a full test and our full review will be up very, very shortly. Thanks for watching guys and I will see you in the next video.